Is that any way to treat an old mate? Refuse to acknowledge him? There's been a mistake. I don't know you, sir. Don't be foolish, Vivian. I'd recognize that mane anywhere. You might play the great dame now, but before that Baron Edward something pulled you from the gutter, you were a common- Enough. The lady said she doesn't know you. Who's this? The new one? Older than the last, it seems. A decrepit, moss-covered prick. So, the less they can, the more they pay. Is that it? You asked for it. Come on, come closer. What? Nothing happened. I've heard ballads about you. Time to invest in new beats. Moritz, what are you doing here? Little Miss Marigold. Well, well. And I was led to believe this would be an elegant affair. Yes, I missed you too. But can we put that aside for now? Do you have a way out of Novigrad? You can join us if you want. Join you? And just who would I join? Your friends, among others. Once we've all gathered, I'll lead you. You will lead? Forgive me, Marigold, but that is like allowing myself to be led by a lame duck. Farewell. Who is that? He's an old friend. His name's Moritz Dyfenthal. Tell you the story later. Invest in rubies. No one is yet. But I intolerance and superstition have always been a Stay away. Gregor, have you seen Durgoff? Just moments ago. Oh, apologies. I mistook you for my friend, sir. He wears a similar mask. General Voris. Geralt of Rivia. So, oh, I was not entirely mistaken. Pleasure, as always. This is... A beautiful and mysterious lady. Let us leave the formalities to the event's end, when all will remove their masks. More fun that way, wouldn't you agree? I would, sir. And now I must beg your pardon. I really must find Durgoff, and quickly. A lovely evening to you both. Apparently. Excuse me a moment. Miss? Yes, it's me. The trout buyer? Hmm? Oh, yes, of course. Please excuse the precautions, but perhaps we could speak somewhere in private. Thank you for agreeing to help. My valet warned me you might come with a friend. I'd prefer as few as possible knew of Albert's flight. But if you trust this man... Like no one else. Any sign of the hunters recently? Since they attacked my servant at the market, none. All has been quiet. But I bribed a man of the temple guard. He claims there's more and more talk of Albert in the ranks. How did the guardsmen learn about your son's interests to begin with? <sighs> Unfortunately, I cannot be sure Albert himself was not the source. Merely boasting about an experiment. He's careless that way. Like his father. A kind man, but a dimwit. Devoured by an Arrakis. I don't know if you've heard. Yeah. Must have traveled far and wide. Hardly. He attempted to breed them. Perhaps I should be pleased Albert adopted alchemy as his hobby. A safe one, relatively speaking. Until recently, that is. Let's get Albert. Where is he? 
entertaining the guests. He's always been an outsized presence at my receptions. I preferred not to arouse any suspicions. When can we take him away? We shall have to wait until the guests have imbibed enough to notice only the goblet-laden trays. Don't fret, it won't be long. How will we recognize him? He's donned a panther mask. He knew you were due to come for him. Seemed rather excited, ironically. I'm afraid he's not fully comprehended the danger he faces. As I said, he's not terribly bright. Don't worry about that. He'll fit right in with a good number of the other mages. Geralt! Let's go find him. I shall await word from you. Let's look for Albert. Scarron Vagel button. I know this might sound immodest, but our hunting hounds are simply nothing. I left out of the way in time, naturally, and it merely singed my eyebrows. Yes. Albert Vagelbud. No. <laughs> I am a black panther. <laughs> oh my, count! Your mom sent us, Mr. Panther. Oh, so you are. Yes. When can we leave the estate? Well, Mama said it would be best to wait until everyone's drunk. Besides, there'll be fireworks later, a jolly good distraction. Once they've begun, I shall slip away, saunter into the garden. We'll meet in the hedge maze. Be waiting for you there. Very well. But first, you absolutely must try the Fiorano Rosé. Absolutely. Hope Albert hasn't forgotten the reason for this whole get-together. Wanna wait in the garden? I saw a nice spot there earlier. Times of famine and war are necessary. They are how society... Then listen to that. Relieved to get that mask off, if only for a little. Great view from here, and there's even wine. It's been so long since I've been to a feast, ball, or reception. Amazingly pleasant change from the sewers of Novigrad. So, does this mean it's a good time to ask you about? Yes. About that mage we met earlier? Ah, oh, Moritz. What do you want to know? Got the impression he doesn't exactly like you. I just think he'd love to have me as his charge, rather than as leader. See, but you're the one organizing the mage's escape from Novigrad. Sometimes I have no idea how I actually managed to bring them all together. They don't have anyone else. Oh, sheesh, thanks, Geralt. If you meant to say something nice, try again. Ah, uh, you look nice. Oh, a witcher's compliments. Someone's coming. <laughs> Is it Albert? No, just some lost guest. Shh. must be looking for his beloved. Like in that elven tale about the frog and the lark. Inchu, inchu, beag broga. Inch by inch, little frog. <laughs> Shh, let's go. Oh. I sure hope the other guests don't get drunk as quickly as I did. 
sooner we get out of here, the better. Oh, no. I plan to have a good look at this famous maze of theirs first. I hear the statues there are completely, entirely... Entirely what? Newt! <laughs> Come on, Geralt! Triss, wait! Geralt! Coming? Gerald, coming? Careful. Miss Merigold, at last! So sorry we are forced to meet under such incredibly inopportune circumstances. You can say that again. But I'm sure we'll make up for it another time. I absolutely must show you my alchemical formulae. Anyone follow you? I don't believe so. Just in case, you two switch masks. We'll go first. Garrett will follow right after. Saddled horses await in the stables. Good. Meet you there. About this private showing. Under any other circumstances, I'd give you the full Monty. Oh, I, I'm sorry, I... Albert Vagelgood. Please, step away, miss. Nobility's not towards your count. Try anything, and you will get bruised. Hmm, <laughs> doubt it. Howling.
Oh, I've begun to worry. Ran into some trouble. Hunters? Will they come here? No, we've got some time. But please send someone to the garden. Needs a little tidying. I shall see to it. And you must hurry. Everything set? Yes. Got your swords back from the guard. And Ingrid gave me the coin. It's, uh, it's more than I expected. Stunning me more, frankly. Glad I could help you collect it. You'll find a good use for it. What happened at the fountain? It was my fault. I know the, the wine went straight to my head. I'm sorry. Triss, don't apologize. Miss Marigold. We need to go. I know. Be careful. Priest's escort. Cuts and punctures. Swords at work. Deserters? Recipe brewed with celandine. Hmm. Should look for the places mentioned. Please help me. Hmm. Sounds sincere enough. Can't be too sure, though. Could be a trap. Medallion's humming. Better investigate. Wolf school insignia. Old. Very old. Long dry. Hemorrhaging fever of some sort. Kira's lamp ought to prove really handy here. Dark energy emanating from these bones. 
Vector's doing? One of the beings Rainbow really mentioned. Another hint. Someone guiding me. Interesting. Bones, dried blood, and mucus. Victims of the Scarlet Fog. Gotta be. Walls are scarred. Human fingernails. The sick wanted out. Badly. Witchers came here. School of the Wolf. Got a bad feeling about this. Who are you? <laughs> Thank you. 
More blood. Was Reynold a witcher? Something's not right. Medallion seething. That stench. Damn it. What are you, filth? The sick rebelled, then paid dearly for it. Signs of torture. Hammer, blood. Like they drove nails into them.
Dwarven spirit, Selendine. Contents of chest. Must mean this chest. Got some Selendine on me. Good thing. Other ingredients seem in decent condition. Reynolds' own recipe looks like. Worth a try. All the signs scream Plague Maiden. Symptoms. More likely a red miasmal. Yeah. Need to prepare. The Lagmites! Destroy them! Free me! Finally! You're here! After all these years! The spirit... Am I asthma? It's still... here... Almost... Almost has control! Uh, hurry! Uh. Reynold? Yes, but... My strength... Fading... The spirit... Taking control... I trapped us in here... The salt... Wondrous... Understand? It can't escape. Hmm. Let it into an apotropaic chamber organically carved into salt. Perfect for a specter. Clever. But I... I feel it in me, still. So long now. Uh, help me, brother. Give me the potion. To expel it, at last! Been down here a while. Have any idea how long? Years. Decades. Time stands still here. Nothing ever changes, brother. Nothing. Longer than that, Reynold. Lots. Gotta understand, you should be dead by now, right? Only thing keeping your body alive is the miasmal? All the more reason to end this! You can do that! The potion! Please! F 
found your letters to Lambert. Was sorry to read he betrayed you. Can't help thinking the miasmal would have bowed before the strength of two witchers. I was a fool, but what's past is past. Lambert, the snake, never deserved my trust. I'll be sure to pass the message along when I see him. Though your friend, believe Osmond was his name. You dare mock me? No. Just got the sneaking suspicion I'm not talking to Reynold right now. Not about to let you leave this mine. Oh, but I will. You are the weaker witcher. I'll kill you, then spread through your viscera, invade your mind! What power? With your strength, I'll crush any who stand in my way! Drown in blood! Choke on their juices, with none but you to thank! Trap us with the air, then force it from my body! Cast a heart to expel it! Stop it regenerating! Deal with the miasma. died centuries ago. Body didn't decompose, though. Likely slowed by the miasmal. Strange. Never seen armor like this before. And the medallion. A wolf's head, but flat. Ah. Uh, Osman finally sent someone. Seems the gods remember this damned veil after all. And you... You have my thanks. I can't believe it's gone. There were moments when I didn't know if I was me or the miasmal. Maybe I was both. Maybe neither. No need for thanks. Should mention, though, wasn't Osmond who sent me. Priest of the Eternal Fire did. Who? 
Who are you exactly? Got a wolf's head medallion, but it's strange. Looks nothing like mine. Strange how? Designed and forged it myself, like all witchers at Kaermorin. Quite the craftsman. Not me, though. Got mine from my mentor, like all witchers at Kaermorin do. Must have been different in your day. Speaking of, when exactly did you arrive here in this mine? Hmm. That was... 970... Or, no, 80. I... I can't recall. Damn memories are foggy. Fractured. Reynold, that's more than 300 years past. 300? No. No! They'd have sent another to find me after five. Ten at most. Osmond himself would have come. I'm sorry. My asthma got lucky you showed, not some mere mortal. Witcher's immunity meant it could possess you without destroying your body. A cruel irony. I had to focus all my strength to prevent it from escaping. Till I locked us in this prison of salt, that is. Before that, it possessed the sick. Quickly corrupted. Deformed them. Turned them into the undying dead. Feral and mindless. All those voices? Torches? Wasn't you, was it? You gotta ask. The miasmal aimed to lure you here. I was too weak to even notice your presence. At least at first. How'd it happen? that you came to be trapped with a miasma. Those cultists hired me to expel it. First sign I might become possessed, though, they panicked. Sealed me in here without a second thought. Could have sent an exorcist. Or... or called for another witcher. Anything. And those poor souls whose bones litter the mine. All forsaken for the glory of the eternal fire. Mm-hmm. I saw. Miasmal tried to impersonate a witcher earlier. You the real, Reynold? How can I be sure? Ask me something only a wolf could know. Come on, let's get this over with. Sure you're from the school of the wolf? Your armor. Can't say there's no resemblance, but the color? Studs, vertical stripes? Back at Kaer Morin, they'd always toss gear my way. Whatever you touch turns to gold, they'd say. This particular suit, I refined on the path. It's supposed to be a prototype for the whole school. Till my time ran out. On your own? No workshop? Missed your calling, sounds like. Could have made a name for yourself as a fine armorer, or at least a tailor. Osmond had ideas of his own, for improvements. Scribbled them down. We were gonna discuss them when we met at Kermoran. I'd like to believe you, really. Got any proof? Search my corpse. Left-hand pocket of the tunic. Diagrams are there, and yours to keep. You're free of the Spectre, but you seem agitated. Need to make sure you'll find lasting peace. <laughs> mean to prevent me from becoming what we hunt. Well... Still got a matter I need to settle. Be a brother. Help me. Then I'll find peace. Could also cremate your body on a pyre as the guild ordains. 
You'd see me leave this world burdened with pain and regret. This is the fate you wish for me, Wolf Brother. A priest sent you, or so you said. Bring him here. I'd like a word for my peace of mind. Why? Aim to have a theological debate? What'll a few words change? Let it go, Reynold. No. Aim to look him in the eyes. Ask him how his religion looks upon those who condemn a man to death and damnation. This kid, he's got no ties to the clerics who sealed you in here centuries ago. Can you offer me them in his stead? No. <laughs> Thought not. No, sorry. Can't risk the boy's life. You've been here too long. Alone with the miasmal. And your own thoughts. I sacrificed all to save others. Believe I'd abandon my convictions to come down hard on one fucking cleric? And you believe, after centuries of torment, that a few words with one fucking cleric will bring you peace? Burn it, then. My body. Be quick about it. And spare me your precious pyre. Sorry it has to end this way. Just be done with it. Matter settled. Mine's safe. Eternal fire be praised. It's a relief to hear it, Witcher. Might I know what you found? Scratch marks on rock walls. The bodies of folk who died in agony. A red miasmal born of their collective suffering. Priests, your brethren, trapped the afflicted in the mine. Condemned them to a cruel death. No. Why, no. You must have misunderstood. My brothers would never abandon their teachings. They came here to help, most certainly. They did. Then they didn't. Hired a witcher once, in fact. Then sealed the mine again with him and the rest inside. Well, you've my gratitude, of course. Though I fear the dark magic in the caverns twisted your judgment. The eternal fire illumines our path. Hate to state the obvious, but it's a fire's nature to destroy. Light's just a side effect. The bodies you found, there's another explanation. The church will get to the bottom of it, I'm sure. Here, your reward. You've my thanks. Godspeed, priest. Now to find Osman's scribblings, the ones Reynold mentioned. Could complete the armor then. Worth a look around next time I'm at Kaer Morin.
Looking for Roach. No one here by that name. Anything else? Move. No, sorry. We talked, it was amusing. Now about face and forward march. Gonna walk in the camp now. Aye. Naturally. And you're gonna go look for hornbills. Aye. I'm going, indeed. Geralt of Rivia. Safe and sound. Vernon Roach, to marry his last hope. Laugh all you want. To marry a will rise again. Roach, I cannot abandon them. I... You can and must, because those are your orders. They'll die, please. We're done. Dismissed. Looking for Horson Jr. I've heard of him. Well, I'm not sure why you think he might be in my camp. Heard some birds chirping. You've got some of the same friends. Both seem to count Radovid among your allies. These birds. They're terribly talkative. I'll need to see them. You'll have to point them out. Mm-hmm. Meantime, Vernon. Willing to help or do I need to keep looking? Mm. As always, you've more luck than you deserve. I'm on my way to meet my Redanian contact. We're meeting near Oxenfurt, at a chess club. Thanks. Knew I could count on you. I free Tamaria without blood. Damn the blood! <laughs> to meet is probably waiting already. Ready? My contact awaits at the chess club. Let's get this over with. Come on. Something's not right. Let's see what. Checkmate. They say it's the game of kings. That chess teaches one to think strategically. What a load of rubbish. Both sides have identical pieces. The rules stay invariably the same. How does this mirror real life? Witcher, do you know why I play chess? To spend time in good company? A king cherishes no one's company. I play chess to reveal the game's secret. Blood thumps inside these chessmen. You need only listen, and you will hear. Dub dub, dub dub, dub dub. A heart pumping with life. <laughs> I take a pawn, and I hear flesh being rent. I win a piece, and I hear screams from the depths of its bowels. 
I want to break the chessmen open. Squeeze the truth from them. Do you see what I mean? No, I don't. <laughs> you do not because you are not a king. Pawns see only their comrades at their sides and their foes across the field. A king has a different view of the chessboard. His greatest foes surround him. His own chessmen might trap him. And that is check and death. You see, Witcher, chess is the art of sacrificing your own pieces. Now do you see? I think I do now. Unimportant. Let us speak. Why have you brought the Witcher here? I think he'd best explain. Expected a Redanian spy. Had no idea we'd be meeting a king. When you've an opportunity to emit intermediaries, I'd suggest you avail yourself of it. I'm looking for Cyprian Wiley, Orson Jr. I know Redania supports him. Why do you seek him? It's personal. Fair enough. I'll not pry. I have placed Junior in a mansion in Oxenfurt. Very few know this. They'll not let you in unannounced. Thus, you must tell them you've come about the new whores. Junior constantly requests fresh women. I hear he doesn't treat them well. You'd just give me a man, after investing coin and time in him? Can't help but wonder why. Consider it a gesture of goodwill. Almost. I'll expect you to return the favor. And also, Junior has lost his purpose. The Big Four is no more. I shall contact you to collect in due course. Now go. And you, Roach. We must speak another time. Radovid's sinking ever deeper into madness as I see it. I know where to find Junior. Don't really care beyond that. Geralt, come to think of it, I too wanted to ask a favor. I have a terrible problem with Vess. Need someone to talk some sense into her. Come see me at the camp. I'll tell you more. Let me think about it. See you, Roach. Now, witches. It's true, you. Slash one, slash left. We'll pay for the free ticket. You've been here. When this is all over, Geralt of Rivia, safe and sound. Mentioned you have a problem. Mm hmm. It's Verse. She took a couple of lads across the river. She plans to hit the Black Ones at Mulberdale. So, sounds about like what guerrilla fighters do. Yes, when they're ordered to. Whereas I forbade her from leaving camp. Indefinitely. Why Mulberdale? Why'd Vesco go there? The peasants from the village aided us earlier. The Nilfgaardians learned of this. 
Word got out they're planning a punitive expedition. Probably hang every fifth villager. Hmm. Honestly, Vess's desire to save the villagers makes sense. What doesn't is your opposition to the plan. War means death. Not only for the soldiers, for the common folk as well. You can't save them all, it's that simple. Funny. Had you for an idealist. You were right to. Are right to. But I have one ideal. A free Temeria. And I'm prepared to sacrifice anything for it. Alright, so you've got a problem. Insubordination. What am I supposed to do about it? I doubt Vess has entered the village. More likely she and the boys lie in wait in the woods nearby. We must find her, before she attacks, and stop her. You're a good tracker. Help me. Count me in. Thanks, Geralt. I'll owe you a favor. Meet me in Velen beneath the Hanged Man's Tree. It's just a short jaunt from there to Mulberrydale. It's the village below, black with Nilf guardians already. They're preparing to execute folk. No sign of Vess. Ah, she may be impetuous, but she's not stupid. She's waiting for her moment. Probably attack after dusk once. Shh. What now? A trio, lightly equipped, sneaking closer, over there near the. Death to the black ones! Help me, Circa! Looks like we're too late. Have you gone completely mental? You ignore my orders, go off on a suicide mission, and instead of donning a breastplate, you dash into battle, shirt open, navel and whatnot exposed. You're not my father, Roach. You've no right to tell me what to wear. But I am your commander, and you will obey me. Guerrilla warfare. Warfare! It involves armies, for fuck's sake. I could not abandon them. They helped us. It's a soldier's job to kill, Bess, not save, not rescue. If that is not to your liking, join the sisters of Melitale. Study to be a healer. Fucking hell. Give me your weapon. You'll get it back when you wise up. If you wise up. Move out! <coughs> 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 Uh-oh. Got yourselves a prisoner. We don't take prisoners. You took my weapon, Roach. So I must manage with my bare hands. Leave him alone. There are corpses enough here. What? You heard me. I did, and I can't believe it. He came here to murder civilians. He's seen us. Will you have him return to his camp and report? Emir knows we can kill his men. Let him learn that we can also show mercy. Roach is right. 
Besides killing a defenseless... What is it with you, Roach? Did the Witcher take your stones? They're sadists. He's the occupier. I will explain later. You, Nilfgaardian, piss off. Morentai. Nes dirmad ava. Go! Before I change my mind. Ah, we should go before a patrol comes along. Thank you, Geralt. Ever need any help? You know where to find me. Farewell. Mark. Hardly ever go in. Not once come out. Boss. What do you want? Where's Horson Jr.? Oh, this one's got bollocks, don't he? I know you, you motherfucker. Saw you kill Olgard and Vic. Uh, must be a misunderstanding. Flank the bastard! Oh, oh. 
what the sandwich fuck is this? No, oh, fuck me. Help me for fuck's sake. No one's coming. Hello, Junior. I've come to talk. I'll do whatever you want. Got a few questions to start with. I'll, I'll tell you everything. I'm looking for a young woman and a minstrel. I know you've met them. A bird? What fucking bird? Ashen-haired with a sword on her back, just like me. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that was... Uh, I, I, I remember. Pay attention now. You'll tell the truth. Wanna know why? I won't lie. Honest. Took me a long time to find you. Wasn't an easy road to travel. I'm angry and tired. Had to kill a lot of people along the way. Some of them tried to cheat me. Some tried to lie. I didn't like it one bit. I feel like one more lie'd be the last bitter drop in a chalice full of sorrow. And then... Then I'd do something I would later regret. Now you know why you can't lie to me? Yes. Good. I'd like to know how the ashen-haired woman ended up meeting you, and what happened to her. What happened to her? She attacked me! Lie one more time, and I'll cut your balls off. <laughs> We'd made a deal. I was to repair their magic filler, what's it? The girl and the songster were to bring me Siggy Reuven's treasure. They didn't, so I might have flown off the handle a bit, I admit. What did you do? I nabbed their flunky, Dodo, and waited for them to come for him. Look, this. Here's what they wanted fixed. A phylactery? You can fix something like this? Not me. I know a guy. Wasting my time, Junior. I need details. I'll tell you, tell you all! Just the way it happened. Got a bad feeling about this. Calm down, Dandelion. We can't leave Doo Doo in Horson Jr.'s hands, you know that. I know, I know, but my gut can't be reasoned with, and no amount of sympathy I feel can silence it, blot it out. Cheer up. We can manage this, I'm certain. Famous last words right there. Have you learned where Horson is keeping Dudu? Room on the top floor. One with the balcony. I'll need to cross onto the roof. Wait for me in front of Junior's house. And... I know it's difficult, but do try to look inconspicuous. If they... if they hurt you, Horson will pay. I must climb onto the roof. Yeah. Room on the top floor. One with the balcony.
There's the balcony. Let's see what's inside. And now, my dear Dodo, I believe I'll try a different tool. Afraid I'm bored with this one. You're fucking balmy, Junior! Anyone tell you that? No. Most say I'm nice. Wants to get to know me. So you enjoy good company? Like to make new acquaintances? <laughs> you plan to introduce me to someone interesting? There you are. Good of you to come. I've been waiting for you. Scurvy old. Where's Ruvin's treasure? I've got you, you little whore. An eye for an eye. Listen, this is what we'll do. Get that fucking whore! That's it, you're in for it! Keep it together, legs! With it. Grab the cut. That's what happened. Told you true. What happened to the woman? Fuck if I know. One of the boys got her in the back, but she's alive, I swear it. Got anything else to say? I've told you all I know. Everything. You hurt the woman I'm looking for. You tortured her friend. She attacked me. I have a right to defend myself. I beg you. Got what I deserved. Have mercy. Please. Let me tell you where things stand. I'm looking for this woman, because she's like a daughter to me. And that's why I just can't let this go. No, no.
seems you've resolved your matters. It's time you return the favor. Radovid doesn't like to wait much, does he? No, he does not. You'll come with us. The HMS Oxenford Tretagore. Once the crown jewel of the Redanian fleet. Decommissioned now, though. Nice boat. You'll need to leave your weapons if I'm to let you aboard. Follow me. The ship was funded with donations from noble women. Ladies who was A spur of the moment patriotic impulse. There you are. Need something from me, Your Majesty? You've never been one to mince words. Very well. Find Philippa Eilhart. That's my wish. I ordered her eyes gouged out once. But apparently her blindness troubles her not. My hunters have detected Lady Eilhart hiding east of Oxenfurt. They have further established that she has magically sealed the entrance to her shelter. Entering it will be difficult. I believe you might succeed in doing so. Bring her to me, alive. Philippa Eilhart? What's she looking for here? I suspect she wants to find her old friends, reconvene the Lodge. Perhaps she seeks revenge on me. Lady Eilhart is known for her persistence. At times, I recall the lessons she gave me when I was a child. Her teachings as memorable as the punishment she meted out. She was subtle and patient in her cruelty. I took her sight, but she remains dangerous. I'd advise you to be cautious. Philip is using magic. You'd be better off sending mages after her. I agreed to the Conclave's revival, but what has this brought me? The Majors at my side are mediocrities, cowards. They couldn't hold a candle to the likes of Eilhart, Loantiel, or Merigold. There's always your witch hunters. You are the best witch hunter. You've proven it clearly. Sheila de Tanzerville and Philippa Eilhart's plan. You were the one to foil it. I want you to finish what you started. Now go to the mountains and bring me Philippa Eilhart. Never seen better. It's a matter of the hand, not the steel it's holding. Pardon me, Witcher Geralt of Rivia. Yeah, what do you want? I have a message for you. Hang on. Who from? Read it. You'll know. Sent by Triss, must have been. I should find her. Oh! 
Guardsmen outside Triss's house. Not good. But I paid in advance the entire month. You did. I'm out of coin. But you've got something else, dear. Give us a necklace and get out of here. Hands off or I'll cut them off. Geralt, you don't need to. I wanna. Grab your things and let's go. Get out! Now! When I need your help, I'll ask for it. What? Are you angry? Ugh, angry? No. But they deserved the necklace. They risked a lot just by sheltering me. They took a risk, sure, for a hefty fee. Yes. The thing is, they could have taken the coin and turned me over to the Hunters, but they didn't, which was extremely honorable by Novigrad standards. Please don't make excuses for them. Geralt, we could debate morals or any number of other topics, but I don't have time for that now. You saw what's happening in the city. How can I help? Everything's falling apart. I don't know where to start. I should get all the mages to the docks as soon as possible. Get them on board this ship. But Berthold and Anise have yet to show up at the meeting point. Berthold and Anise. Who are they? A young couple. He's an alchemist. Had a practice in Gildorf. She studied at Eratusa. I'm worried the people who hit them might have turned them in. See? My hosts weren't all bad. Won't be easy getting to the port. Lots of guardsmen in the streets. So we won't take the streets. In case of trouble, we were all to meet at the Kingfisher. There's a passage into the sewers from the cellar, and apparently those can get you all the way to the docks. I know the Novigrad sewers. Won't run into any hunters there, but that doesn't mean it'll be safe. That's why I'm asking you. I need you to find the way to the docks, clear the path for the others, and do it quickly. The hunters could figure out our plan any minute. Now you understand my predicament? Mm hmm Help too and put all the others at risk. Or go straight to the Kingfisher, abandon the two to certain death. What do I do, Geralt? can't risk everything, everyone, for two people. It's unwise and immoral. I was afraid you'd say that. Fine. Let's go to the Kingfisher. Check the sewers beneath the Kingfisher? No. Didn't think we had to that route. To think a year ago, guardsmen bowed to mages they passed in the street. Now we have to flip a patrol. We can't let them see us. Lately. Ah, damnation. All right. They're gone. Come on. 
No guardsmen or hunters in sight. Everything seems in order. Or we're too late. Yes. Thanks be to Melitile. Anyone from the Silverton hideout make it? Odette, Kaspar, Dittmer, and Yana. Hagen? He... He won't be coming. Quickly, before someone comes in. Trace, we were so concerned. Right to be. Hunters were on my trail. Gerald, wait a minute. I need to see who made it. Why the tears, my dear lady? You shouldn't worry yourself. It tarnishes your beauty. Guess you must have worried quite a bit. No, I was born ugly. You fleeing to Kavir too? No, but I am helping the others set off. You know me. Bleeding hard. start bleeding now. They've been burning mages for months around here. But only since recently on this scale. Besides, I look forward to having friends in Kavir, especially among King Tancred's entourage. Shh. Trace is about to speak. We'll talk later. We've waited long to escape. Till we could make sure Kavir will take us. Till we could acquire enough coin to hire a ship. So we could find a captain we could trust. We've waited too long. There's no more time for hesitation. We must leave Novigrad today. This is madness. Hunters stand on every corner. So we'll get to the port through the sewers. Garrett will clear a safe path for us. They'll catch us anyway. You'll see. They'll catch us and kill us. Perhaps. In which case we'll die with dignity. Weapons in hand. Not tied to a stake, begging for mercy. If the need arises, I'll defend you. You can also count on my help. Yes, the help of a Redanian spy, Radovid's right-hand man. That was long ago, sir. You raised that madman. You taught him to kill. You. This is no time to settle past scores. End of discussion. Gonna enter the sewers now. I'll signal when the path's clear. You follow my trail, and don't stray from it, no matter what. I will go with Geralt. You, Dijkstra, go to the port and see that everything's in order with the ship. On my way. We'll meet there. I hope. Triss, really want to go with me? No offense, but- Offense taken. Stop talking and lead the way. I swear it. I'll drop magic for good. If I can only bloody get out alive. You can't, you won't. You've got Radovid and the church against you. Magic to vanish. Us along with it. Good luck. Thanks for helping. No need to thank me, really. There's another way. Where? The passage is a narrow, not a single fork. 
But listen, there's an echo behind the walls, and I can feel air coming in through the cracks. So, something on the other side? Mm-hmm. Elven ruins, or an old forgotten cellar. Maybe we can get around the blockage through there. Can't hurt to try. Got nothing to lose at this point. Library? Look! Gonzalo Perseo's poem. Jacob of Veraz's Chronicles is incredible. Rare, first editions only. We'll come back for them later. I remember. Just having a hard time coming to grips with it. Chris, found an exit. headquarters. Can't be a coincidence. His debtors have tended to disappear without a trace. Everything all right? A few bites on my feet and cough. Nothing really. Need to clean your wounds. Infection will set in otherwise. Later, Geralt. Let's find a way to the port first. around the neck and shoulders. Claw marks, long and sharp. Lantern still lit. Died recently, from bites to the neck. A lesser vampire. Stay close to me. It's a catacan. A what? A vampire. Watch out for its venom. Source of income. 
Come on, let's go. Finally. You bloody took long enough. Did you have time to look around? How's the ship? Creaky piece of junk. Woods rotting. Sails are prone to rip like an old pair of knickers. And Will the... we make it to Kavir? Provided you don't run into any storms. I'll signal the others to come. Any help? Can I play the violin for you? Fetch some flowers or bonbons. What the hell's that mean? What? Don't tell me you don't plan to beg her to stay. Why do you even care? I adore love stories. Especially the ones that end happily ever after. Hunters! Hunters approaching! Board the ship! We want them alive! <laughs> Big I don't know how to... No time for courtesies, my dear. Get on board. One last farewell. Thank you. I'll never forget what you did for me. And what we had together. Stay with me. Geralt, not this again. Especially not here. Not now. Miss Marigold, we got a sale. Please. We had our chance, but let it go. I, I love you. Miss Marigold, we're casting off. Well, mate, at least you tried. A sorceress turned me down once. Want to hear the story? Go for it. What's the harm? As you know, my heart fluttered for Philippa Eilhart back when we both served Redania. One day, I doused myself in fragrances like a whore in a heat wave, put on a pinstripe doublet, they make you look slimmer, you know, and I went to her, told her, Philippa, with so much in common, and so on. Know what she said? Pinstripes hadn't slimmed you down enough? No. She said, Geralt, turn around. Not in the mood for jokes. No, I'm serious. Turn around. Triss? I thought... So did I. But I changed my mind. Good thing women can be changeable. Dijkstra, no offense, but... Leaving, already gone. Let's go somewhere. I know a spot where we can watch the ships. Lead the way. You're safe now, right? Yes, you can stop worrying, really. 
Oh, you're right. Just hard to believe it's over and done with. I've dreamt of this moment for months. Promise me one thing. You'll stop risking your life for others. No. No? Tris, not a mage left in Novigrad. But you're here. I can defend myself. Well, from Kekimores, Griffins, Bruxay, but not from the hunt. You and Siri will need my help, and I'll be at your side. This how you imagined things? No. I imagined I'd be on the ship with the rest of them, and you'd be on shore, waving a handkerchief, maybe. I hope you don't regret it, that things have gone differently. Well, they say Kavir's lovely this time of year, but I prefer you. <laughs> Not surprised. I'm pretty lovely this time of year, too. I won't disagree. We might still go there one day, when it's all over. That would mean balls and banquets, and other boring things that start with a B. Mm-hmm, but also baths, bombs, body massages. You can make up for all those years you slept in the bushes and bathed in mountain streams. Sounds tempting. Would I have to give up being a witcher? No, you'd take a monster contract from time to time to stay sharp. Nothing too dangerous, though, so I wouldn't have to worry. And I'd be waiting for you. Let me guess. With a candlelit dinner? Candles, sure. And a bed. Actually, we've never needed either. Look! They're signaling us. It's a message. H. L. A. K. B. R. Hul... Lakba. It makes no sense. It's code. What did you expect? Thank you, Geralt, for this, and for what you said at the port. I should have said it long ago. So, what happens now? I'm afraid it's a bit too early for happily ever after. We'll get our happy ending one day. Yes, somewhere over hill and dale. It's a cruel world we live in. It's hard to make plans. Even harder to invest any faith in them. Though you might want to, badly. You were in an entirely different mood a moment ago. Hush. The spark expired. Don't worry about me, Geralt. And please, be careful. I've got to find Ciri. I'm close. I will find her, or someone who knows what happened to her. Where will we meet? Can only think of one place where both witchers and sorceresses are welcome. Care more, and haven't been there in a while. So, I guess I'll see you, witcher. I'll miss you. A lot. I'll miss you too. fragrance, acrid sweat, and chestnut balm for aching joints. 
Dijkstra. Ah, those witches' senses. Can't hide a damn thing from you lot. Same seems to be true for you. Will you ever leave me alone? Someday, sure. Once I no longer need you. <sighs> Dijkstra, what are you plotting this time? What would you say? How many mages did we save, altogether? Dunno. Didn't count. Thirty, maybe, give or take a few. And how many would you say remain in the North? How many alchemists, healers, herbalists? Two thousand? Three? Doing a population count? Is that it? No, I'm concerned. In Novograd they had us, we were here. But who'll save those in Rimba, Banard, Ard Kareg? Gullet. You know damn well that daft bastard Radovid won't rest till he's killed them all. Every last one. Yennefer and Triss included. Moving as speeches go. Now get to the point. Why are you telling me this? Because I want you to help me kill Radovid. You that concerned about the mages of the world? Expect me to believe that? Actually, yes. But not because I'm sensitive or it gives me a heartache, true. To my mind, this systemic persecution is foremost a symptom of a far more serious problem. A madman rules Redania. I served Vizimir, Radovid's father, was his head of intelligence for more than two decades. Together, we transformed Redania, made it the North's most powerful realm. Any idea what made it strong? It's armies, I'd wager. And you'd bloody lose, you idiot. Mass mobilization? Inciting peasants to take up their scythes, straighten them? Where's the art in that? Much harder to build a strong state with healthy commerce, manufacturing, solid alliances, progressive science, and fair, independent courts that hand down just judgments. Vizimir and I managed to do just that. Through years of fucking hard work. I will not sit on my hands as that little shit squanders that. Radovid the stern, my ass. Radovid the witless, I'd say. Will you help me, Geralt? I don't kill kings. Just not a regicide. Rumors to the contrary be damned. I know. I'm merely asking for your aid in organizing the assassination. Someone else will strike the blow. <sighs> Dijkstra. Might not have heard this, though I'd find that hard to believe. But witchers are neutral on principle, so... Oh, bollocks. That's a convenient excuse you lot try to hide behind every time the temperature rises. It's grown hot, my friend, and it grows hotter still. Pyres burn in every city. For majors, great and small, your female friends included. For non-humans, for witchers soon. Is that the North you espouse? The North you're prepared to live in? Silence. Cards close to your chest, I understand. To slay a king, it's not exactly some bloody necker contract. You think on this. Think on what I said. And if you conclude you'd rather change the course of history instead of riding its current to hell, you come find me. At the Passiflora in the garret. I'll be waiting with my mates. I'll think about it. So long, Geralt.
much back in there. But Commander, it's full of monsters and traps. Heathen. Dragged out four wounded. Maybe. And Chest completely crushed. Ribs must have pierced the lungs. Having trouble? Nothing fucking but. One ploughing trouble after the other. But what's it to you? Who are you? A means to solve your troubles. Radovid sent me. No, oh, it's you. I've been waiting for you. Don't exactly sound delighted. Would you expect us to? We've done half the work. Now you show up and take all the glory. Word was you hadn't been able to get inside. Till yesterday, when we found this. Doesn't look like much, but it's got power of some sort. Opens the entrance. Great. I'll take that now if you don't mind. Here, choke on it, you twit. Time I saw if Philip is still in there. Don't count on anyone going in to retrieve your corpse. that opens this door. Missing one tile. Perfect hideout for an owl. Be a bit harder for me to move around. Portals, great. And the witch hunters probably messed with them. Works. Who would have thunk? Eight portals. Make my stomach turn. A remix. It's Edge Frayed. This is an owl feather. Mm hmm. Neckers. Might have expected as much. They love places like this. How do you like that silver? One step closer. Sheathe that before you hurt yourself. Wait, wait, wait. You, you, you that witcher the king was supposed to send? Guessed it. You should know by now how dangerous this place is. On the way up above with the others. Not a chance. Those cowards ran at the first whiff of monsters. I made a stiffer stuff. Besides, something big set to happen here. I just know it. I learn what it is. Radovid will appreciate it. King will promote me. Maybe even give me a medal. What's the big event that's supposed to happen? Uh, don't know the details, but I came across Philippa Eilhart's notes. Mentioned Ida Emian, Margarita Lowe and Teal, Francesca Finderbear, and Frangela Vigo. As I see it, they aim to meet here. Think Philip is still here? Can't really know. Sure, we searched a few caverns, but hidden nooks abound. If someone wanted to hide in here, they could easily. Even if they weren't an owl. All right. Let's get you out of here. Told you already. No chance. Besides, the teleport's power cell. I broke it off. We have to wait till they come for us. 
Got no choice. Nobody's gonna come for us. Give me the crystal, I'll get us out of here. But the monsters? I'll defend you. What if you can't? Be a good little hunter and give me the crystal. I am a good little hunter. There you go. Right. Now to activate it. Sentry. survived.
crystal from a megascope. Heavily chipped. You're alive. Find anything? Cremated notes, a necker nest, rats. Nothing interesting. Why don't I believe you? Telling you the truth. Awfully prone to suspicion, you hunters. Not without reason. Grab him! Spread out! Witcher, any progress? Have you found Isleheart? No, I wasn't in her hideout, but I found this crystal there. If I'd wanted a shiny bauble, I would have gone to a jeweler. You were to bring me Isleheart. This is a Megascope crystal. The mages you keep in prison should be able to extract something from it. Yes. Hmm. Huh. At last. They might prove useful. Not exactly what I expected, but... Very well. You've earned your pay. Now forgive me. I have affairs to which you must attend. 